I hope the light is okay. Um, <clears throat> I thought I'd do a, a quick video on Chantal and Salah's recent visit to the museum. What was it? The um, let's have a look. The Beit Al Othman Museum. Oh, part one. They're going to do, do a part two. Well, let me turn this light off. That's better. <clears throat> well, I was a bit shocked at seeing how utterly round she is. She is a total rotunda. That's, that's all I can call her. Totally round. Um, so we'll have a look at this. Um, the live I was going to do at three, a couple of people have said that they're working. So could I put it back a little bit? So I'll do it at the usual time that we, we normally have a, a live stream, which is about six, between six and 6.30. So, I mean, any time is okay for me, but if that's better for everybody. Um, so I say about six, 6.30, I'll put the notification out later. So let's have a look at this video. Hey guys, we are here at the Better of Man Museum. Hey guys, Hello. This museum features Kuwaiti culture from predating the oil time to current time. So come on, Yella, let's learn something. So excited. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> They've got a little bit better at doing the vlogging, I think. Thank you. Souvenir shop. ATM. Oh, nicely air conditioned. Right by the souvenir yeah, like shop. The only people here. <laughs> They're the only ones there again. Yeah. I feel like I'm in the 1900s. Yeah. 1900s, well, it wasn't so long ago, was it? Kuwaiti culture from the pre oil era up until about now. Catalog, nice. <clears throat> that seems to be one of her favourite so, words yeah. now, doesn't it? Nice. History. The stewards. There's the economy seats. Go on, sit in it, dare you. How is it? <laughs> Hello, ma'am. I need a seatbelt extender. Oh. Put your seatbelt, please. Excuse me, your seatbelt. She only just fits in that. Oh, okay. <laughs> In that business class. It's got a Saudi on this one. <laughs> <laughs> Inshallah. Don't think I'll let you in, Saudi. 1970 to 1974. And here 1979 to 1982. You see, notice how it was in Kuwait with the, um, the stewards, the stewardesses with the bare arms and necks, they're slightly more modest now. This one, 1985 to 1989. And here we have 1989 it's... to 1993, my year of birth. Mm. Cool. Hello, oh, baby. Look Sorry. how round she is. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So here the captain or what? Yeah. I'm the captain. Yeah, you have to be the captain. She wouldn't fit in that seat. Okay, we'll go in front of me. Okay, we'll go on the lead. And this one. Scandal strike. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I mean, wait, wait. <laughs> I went wild. Salah trying to look intelligent. Danger. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Bad acting. <laughs> Thank you. 
literally bunches, pins. And here, baby, the Kuwait Sandy airstrip. Yeah. 1932. All it was was desert. There was nothing in Kuwait till they struck oil. Interesting. Bus. Yeah. The new you look like a bit of a bit of an airbus yourself. That music that she plays. Wow, look at that. Wow. Digital flight data recorder. The yeah. black box. And here we have the rescue items. Well, if you were flying, I'd certainly need them. Interesting. Piloting. Since 1954. Okay. That music, please turn it off. Wow, this is gorgeous. Oh, she's nice. Take a look. Oh, it's gone off. She didn't stay on that for long, did she? I wanted to see more of that. Interesting. Since 1954. Okay. Wow, this is gorgeous. So tell us what it is, Chantal. Tell us what that is. There's no information at all about what that is meant to be. Beautiful colours. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I just don't know what that is. That's a chair, obviously, for somebody important. And a canopy. Maybe that's the... I don't know, the royal cabin or something. Got no idea. Quality currencies. Money. Oh, who knew grasshoppers would have been so valuable? Huh. A ghee jar. Dry lemon. We don't need this. Get something that's interesting. Look at the telephones. That pale blue phone is the one that I've got downstairs in my lounge. Exactly the same, except that it's um, to round dial, but you actually push the buttons. You don't, um, you know, twirl it round. It's the same, same phone. So this is where they're going to show us pictures of the martyrs, in other words, the soldiers and um, military who died during the Iraqi war. They call them martyrs. I, I find that strange, calling the troops martyrs. And what we're going to see here, I guess, is some of the personal effects of them. The, the people who died and you'll you'll see a tube of half squeezed toothpaste bit strange creepy some of their personal items is that their yeah. toothpaste is that toothpaste yeah a lot of brave men here oh I have to what it is today. look at the size of it Rest in peace. Shahada al Kuwait. Allah yarhamhum. This is Chantal at her unbearable, obsequious best. Where she's talking about all the brave men who made Kuwait what it is today. 
you do know that the Americans and the British and the Saudis also were involved in that war, don't you? Honestly. Victor. Rest in peace. What does that even mean to you, Santa? Well, come home. The Martin Museum, where Murad filmed. And the same decoration. Yeah. They're bricks. Oh, that music. This looks like oh. Just look. Look at the size of her. That abaya wasn't quite so tight when she first bought it. She is completely spherical. A complete ball with a little ping-pong ball atop of the mass. What a terrible ma mess. Not your war, Chantal. She's crying. This is outrageous. Amira, do you want? Look. The Royal Gathering. Yeah. Look at the state of her. He's yeah, getting some body shots of you, isn't he? Yeah. Until Sheikh Nawaf Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah for now. Wow. It's a real sword, guys. Oh, more swords. And this one is safe pass. No. Nice ship, huh? She would sink it. Fortunate you got those uh, filters, isn't it? Cold water, this is the life. <laughs> Hello, Sheriff. How are you doing? I'd like to make a complaint. Someone stole my pickles. <laughs> oh. oh. Scared me. Yeah, yeah. Got the camera off those slim females quite quickly. 
<laughs> the penguins. <laughs> is that it? I guess that's it. What a size she is. My goodness. That was an abrupt ending, wasn't it? So I guess there's going to be a part two. I'll see you later. Live stream about 6.30. Bye-bye.